Hello and welcome fellow gamers, my name is Borek and this is another episode of 7 days to die. Yes, we are back and we are back at our base and in today's episode probably we'll just go a bit chillaxed because uh, recently we've been going around like a maniacs. I mean, we went to the hub city, we had some funsies there, we have found some weapons, well basic parts at least. Uh, my gathering, well, scavenging quality is not that high, and that's why I don't have unlocked uh, level 3 quality Joe. But still, uh, we got two sort of uh, shotguns. I have one ordinary shotgun with me. Uh, well, no, I have put it in actually in the in the closet over there, uh, downstairs. Uh, so in today's episode, we will be starting out a farm. Yes, sir. Uh, we need to start growing some stuff, though probably the alpha. Well, actually, this is. I don't need to do it, but well, anyway, let's do it, uh, because you don't need to plow. Uh, or tilt your dirt, your your uh, ground. All you need to do is just dig it out uh, with a shovel and to replace uh, the ground, and then you can actually place the seed. So recipes. Let's go with the corn seed. Seven. Yeah, we'll be making seven uh, because I don't want to constantly scrap. Don't scrap it. Potato seeds. Yes. So let's make potato seeds as well, and. Actually, I think the corn will grow pretty much everywhere. Uh, so let me just plant those guys. I mean the potatoes. Now let's use. Let's try the corn. Can I plant the corn? Because at some point in seven days to die, you were able to plant it in the middle between the tilted dirt, the tilted ground. Uh, well, I wish I had some put, uh, some seeds with me, but unfortunately, I've been scrapping them a lot. Maybe if we would go back into the graveyard, I would find some in the graves because I don't know. Uh, the graves seem to be the best place to get seeds. I don't know why, but anyway, I think I have left some seeds back at the hub city. Hmm. But we're not gonna go there uh, in today's episode because there is really no point of doing that i think we need to replace those guys uh, those guys as well i mean uh you know just repair the defenses because the defenses are really important even if you have like the concrete walls and all that jazz installed but all to all uh, these small spikes are still op as fuck and i will not hesitate and use them and since the zombies do not dig down i think i might try to level this thing oh shit that's not good uh, they don't dig down but they do uh, will be beating on that um, particular rock uh, shovel we need a shovel because we need to fill that thingy above and let's go and dig maybe even some some clay would be nice i think it can do the trick and it goes like crazy and i can actually um, get some mining levels because well i still need to improve that and get some more and even get some more what do you call them levels for my guy and actually the ground itself is being digged out in two hits it would be better to of course use um, the proper steel shovel but i have placed it downstairs and now it makes me think if i actually can use this that's just a lump of clay Fuck. Mm, that's not good anyway yeah that's not good. Uh, so I was thinking maybe we should go around for a trip somewhere over here and check out what lies... Well, I do know what lies beyond there because before my game crashed, I actually uh, went there and saw that thingy above. But it's 6 p.m. Hmm. 
let me just uh, think about it uh, now it's day 17 so in two days time the doggish will doggies will show and we need to be prepared and we are not prepared whatsoever as you can see <laughs> this thing is still away from being prepared because uh, well the ferals will come in the next horde and even if the alpha 15 is being war is being war worked on we still need to defend ourselves right so i'm really quite happy about the alpha 15 i've been watching all the videos that the uh, joel has been posting lately and yeah that's really insane uh i mean at least the navs again uh, because um not random gen you know the town and the stuff uh the towns in the navs gen navs gen whatever that is called but for now i think i just want to pick up some potatoes to cook maybe something i would like to get a shitload of corn but we don't have any corn nearby this is not a cornish biome but i need to start gathering some metal as well so i think we will be skipping we will be skipping that uh, thingy above called trips to another town at least for quite some time now at least not Ooh, survivor's briefcase mm -hmm. this was a lucky find all we need to do right now is find the key for it to get some goodies although they are not the goodies that you would expect out of that uh, suitcase this is not the suitcase that you are starting with but still you may find some goodies i have uh, uh, unlocked one i have been able to find one key actually i don't remember where was it but for now we can just sneak up on the lady in the back just to have some fuzzies and decapitate her ugly head well actually she had half of her of her head and unfortunately she didn't gave us anything and i don't see any more zombies around here that would oh hello hello no i'm gonna not, not gonna chase you i'm just gonna pick up all the potatoes around here there's the fat so there's the deer mm, and there's a shit out of zombie and the time is running out so yeah we really need to watch out for that do i have that bow on me that would be really awesome um yep i still have it though i have stop moving please nope i guess i've missed you or i'm just hitting the tree ha <laughs> oh and the stack party completed as well how cool is that don't you think actually i have never been that far in this direction now we are gonna be smelly and they will start running quite soon but no biggie no biggie we can deal with that i have a shotgun on me <laughs> so let's go and get that sucker out and fortunately now we can make we can start making hello whoa baby you actually hit me how not nice of you this was really nice and you even wanted to explode mm. but at least we got 13 bullets back oh some trash let's see what we can find oh nice lad lead is good because i am running low on lead I am running low on lead and uh, during the night time I think I need to go down uh, into the mine and far try and find some nice ore deposits although this biome is not as good in terms of finding the ores as I would like it to be but nevertheless it's cool sweet so there's absolutely nothing in the area except for the zombie uh, going around but we might go and get him do i have my pick on me yes because i think we should start collecting those rocks as well since i need no 
since I need iron. What is that? Don't feed the past. No, I don't care about it. But I saw another deer over there. But I would like to get maybe another forge going, though I think I have three downstairs. Oh, hello. Stop running away. Oh, you don't run away from me. I think I'm aiming too low. I really suck at the wooden bow thingy above. I really do. See? I don't know if I'm aiming too high, too low or whatever. And I'm just, you know, wasting all the feathers. Oh, speaking of the devil. Nice, thank you, eight feathers. Probably I've just waited, wasted 16 on that deer, but still, let's try and get him, shall we? And let's hope that we won't come across any dogs right in the buttsies. Nice, that was really nice. So let's get that foodsies and the fatso and what else? Hide, of course, hide is really important. The fat is important. Actually, everything is important. Right, but I think that is the high time that we continue moving towards our base. Because, oh, there's a barn. And I don't like barns. Why I don't like barns? Because there are dogs near barns. Oh, nice. Though I think I have shitloads of it back home, but let's use this opportunity and let's just mine it. Maybe we came across... Um, coal as well so on the way back we can just you know produce some gunpowder that would be really awesome but for now I can just get those oh it is so sweet to have the steel tools and look at me go bam 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 and see you later sucker you are out right um, hello I don't think that's gonna be it, no, but maybe second hit in the head will do, I guess it does, sweet, ah, that's a bummer, right, nope, nothing interesting, but the coal is here, and it makes me wonder, do we have a room, no, we don't, uh, rotting flesh, uh, play ball I can make, so let's take those guys and let's actually start making some gunpowder, should we? This way we will be able, oh, we will be able to, you know, just increase our gun making skills and increase overall level. Sweet! So that is done. There is another deer. How lucky I am today with those deers. Especially with the sniper rifle. Ha <laughs> ha Sweet. Okay, so we have 45 minutes left and we need to go into our bunker down below and start organizing ourselves. Maybe I will just make a tour because I don't know if I have actually showed you uh, in all its glory. I mean, uh, our vault down below. It's not the hatch, fallout hatch, but still, but still it's nice to have a protected area right still I haven't um, I haven't came with an idea how to properly go up so for now we will just do that north pole our way up yep that's gonna be enough and I need to make those trussings and make iron bars around this tower because this is going to be our defensive tower where, the, where while the main fighting area sorry will be over there and I have already made myself a ladder over here so that we don't break and legs is there anything over here no so let's go down for the night into the depth of the unknown right so i think i have completely moved all of the stuff 
down to here and I have done this because even if I I have this you know pit over here which is really awesome and you can actually uh, change those things with uh, pillars as well but I'm doing those uh, one quarter uh, quarter blocks right so what do we have we had some, we have some food animal fat we will we'll go over there look at that i have planted four potatoes and i have 31 32 already on me so this is really awesome um yes they start running they have started running uh feathers feathers i don't know if i'm gonna continue doing that because i wanted to make myself a crossbow maybe cross would be enough um, it's only 10 so it's I think it's a quite nice ranged weapon so I'm gonna go with that though next level requires fletching and archery level oh, fletching oh that's quite interesting um, but we're gonna skip the fletching cause I have a bullet tumbler over here I don't need those oh look at that we got 40 so we can make two bellows actually um, Right, what do I wanted to do? I wanted to get the steel arrows because I have found already 86 steel arrows. We can actually make some more. Let's take those feathers. Um, let me just drop this off here 120 lead tumbler. Let me just re reorganize that and actually yeah, i will drop this because we don't really need it so we cannot do anything with the iron arrows but we can still do something with the bones what can we do we, we can do the glue but i'm gonna take the rotting meat so we can make some chemical and agent at right around here which is a really great way to, in, to, to increase your med, medicine, medical uh, medicine skills. Look at that, we are at level 16 and we are beyond S. So if we do just one, uh, one chemical agent, which just like took one second, well, nothing changed. But if we make a shit bunch, like 23, I think, that's a miscrafting. Since when that is miscrafting? That sucks. Hmm. Well, actually, that's quite interesting, but that sucks. Because the miscrafting, I can make, you know, shitloads while making uh, kits. I mean, uh, kit, kit, kit for upgrading the wood blocks. So let's not deal with that. Uh, the best way to increase medicine skill actually is make a tallow and then produce fuel logs. Do I, th I think I have some tallow on me. So let's try that out. Uh, fuel log. So if you remember, the medicine skill is beyond S. And if we make one fuel log, which will just take like five seconds, we should increase our skill. No. So, what do we need the chemical station for? That has that must have been changed. Okay, fair enough. And now. I think we're gonna be burning. Uh, lead is the lead over here, yes. So let's start burning. We're gonna need a back shot, yes, we will. But actually, I have this very something chemical somethings. Let me just turn this on. And we have actually, yeah, and those as well. Hmm. Uh, let me just start crafting this. Let me just do this and this and blah blah blah. And. Uh, blah 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 let me just put this fuel log over here turn this off now it should be okay okay this takes like 18 minutes of burn time so everything should be burned uh, in the matter of just a few seconds and now if we go to armory is that armory no that decorative and this is the armory and let me just put the tumbler pull that tumbler over here and now <coughs> having steel arrows recipes we can make a steel crossbow bolts uh, 
and let me just double check that so the fletching is level 15 by level so let's let's see if we gonna increase our fletching skill or not I don't think so because it shouldn't be connected although in a way that should be a thing don't you think hmm no I don't see any I don't hear any noises no it's not moving it still was at this thingy a jig so I'm I'm gonna craft those still still crossbow bolts and I need a steel steel arrow heads calipers so let's get the calipers I had some over here like so actually this base is not organized as I would like it to be but still uh, we're gonna need 19 like that Actually, let me just double check. Rebar, rebar. We can make scrap cable. How interesting. I never knew that that was a thing. Uh, but anywho. Hmm. What I wanted to do? Don't know. Just don't remember. Oh, sometimes my memory is so so slow right so let me just get rid of this one thing here jig i hope i can burn it yes i can oh yeah the back shot but no first i wanted to check the shots shotgun because we can make shotgun slugs i don't know that incinerary shed i don't know that either but that would be awesome thing to have don't you think um but there was chemical something chemical shells yes so we don't actually need backshot for that all we need is a chemical engine shotgun shotgun shell casing hmm that's quite interesting and for the shotgun shell casing i think all we need is a paper so i'm going to queue up some paper uh, some shotgun shell casing paper that's going to take me just a three minutes but I have all the time in the world and get rid of this and get rid of this so we can make some casings and those incendiary shells that would be a really awesome thing to have but I think we need to increase something yeah and it takes 20 points so that sucks but there is no requirements for the second tier and since we are wasting and since we are wasting no not bot one more whoa what the heck just happened i don't know okay Well, my menu decided that it's not going to work anymore. Right. Uh, so I think it's almost uh, the time to, you know, end, end the video. And probably uh, tomorrow I will be digging down um, in search for another uh, ore vein. So, yeah. I think that's going to be it for today's episode. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, hit that like button section down below. Comment about the gameplay. And I hope I will see you each other in the next episode. So till then, take it easy. Have fun. Happy gaming. Bye-bye.